Hey everyone, I'm back with another wellness related video. Um, I know that a lot of my videos are fun and silly, but I do really want to incorporate more of like my daily routine and kind of uh, wellness related stuff onto this channel because I feel like that's something that I'm really passionate about. And if I'm going to be showing myself on the internet, why not? show all of it. Now this does not mean there will be no more reactions or me being dumb on the internet. Um, it just means that like sometimes here and there I want to incorporate other things that I'm passionate about or things that I really love or things that have worked for me that I want to share with you. So for example I did a couple videos a while back about making detox water which helps with like kind of like cleansing your skin and bloating and all that stuff. I did a video about different supplements that I take and I do plan on doing a skincare related video at some point because that's just something that like I love to do. This is a video that I wanted to make because uh, it's something that I've been struggling with and I've been trying to find solutions so if it works for me maybe it'll work for you. As you may know I moved about six months ago and for some reason after I moved I just like stopped sleeping. Like I couldn't fall asleep, I couldn't stay asleep, I wouldn't feel rested. The whole next day I would be exhausted which by saying the whole next day, I mean like literally every day because this just kept happening every single night. No matter what I did, I could exercise, I could, you know, tire myself out, I could watch TV before bed, I could do literally anything, could not sleep. At first I thought, okay, I'm in a new environment, <laughs> I have a new bed, new mattress, there's someone sleeping next to me, like all these things could totally be the reason why I'm not sleeping. But nothing I was doing was helping it. At this point, I still don't know exactly what it was that was messing me up or if it was a combination of things but I have kind of got myself in a system where I am sleeping pretty normally so I figured I would kind of share a little bit about my nighttime routine what my bedding is like and things like that just to maybe share the knowledge in case you're having this issue maybe what works for me doesn't work for you but maybe it does before bed this is an a thing that I have always done, this is not new to like just now, but just to kind of incorporate my whole thing. Before I go to sleep, I always wash my face and do like my whole skincare routine. It's not super long or in depth and I will make a video about it eventually, but it's one of those things that just kind of feels meditative to me because I just sit there in the bathroom by myself and just like, you know, give myself a nice little face massage and just start to bring myself down and relax. Once I get into bed, I started doing this Literally, like, I've been doing it all of 2021. Um, I really enjoy reading, but I felt that I was, like, not finding time for myself to read. So I made, like, a pact with myself um, to read at least one chapter a night every night. Sometimes I read more. Some days I read the whole day because I get really sucked into a story. But I won't go to bed until I've read at least one chapter. So now I've done my skincare routine. I've read a chapter. <sighs> I'm, like, unwinded, ready to go to sleep. But for me, that still wasn't enough. I tried everything. I tried like sleep sprays, essential oils, all that stuff was great. It made my pillow smell nice and the air in my room smell nice, but it was not putting me to sleep. I have this duvet cover that I got off Etsy that feels kind of like heavy, which, you know, weighted blankets are supposed to help you sleep better. So I don't know if that's working for me because it's heavy, but I like the way it feels regardless. Um, I also have pillowcases and um, sheets that are really soft and cool because this room gets extremely hot. Even right now, I'm like, <laughs> I'm dying in here. It's so freaking hot in here. Um, so it's important to me that my bedding is cool. All of these things together kind of create a good environment for sleeping. However, you can have all the things perfect and still not fall asleep, and that is what was happening to me. And I think that for most people, some of these other things may be just what they need, like just enough, like, okay, like my, pillowcase is nice and cool. Oh, I can relax and go to sleep. Oh, I read before bed. My mind is shut off. I'm ready to go to sleep. Yeah, for me, no. <laughs> None of this was working. So I decided to try some sleep gummies. You know that I have used the Sugar Bear hair gummies in the past. I still use them. Um, I did that video about all the supplements and they were part of that. So I decided to use their sleep gummies and try them out and see if I like them. So these are them. I don't know if you can see this. There we go, sugar bear sleep vitamins. So they're basically melatonin. It's six milligrams of melatonin. Um, I've tried other melatonin supplements and nothing has happened or I've tried some other ones and felt like 
dead after and I have a lot of friends that have experienced the same so with these I don't feel like exhausted the next day I don't feel like gross after taking them basically you take two before bed it says within a half hour of going to sleep so a lot of times I will take it right before I start reading so I take it read my chapter by the time I'm done with that kind of like relax for a few minutes and go to sleep I actually have found that these help I take them every single night sometimes I give one to my boyfriend if he's having a restless night as well and he really likes them they taste delicious just like the hair gummies they are vegan which is really awesome if you're vegan a lot of times you know there's supplements especially gummies that you can't take luckily for you these are vegan if you get the three month supply you also get a couple other little goodies that we use a lot in my house so one of them is this sleep mask how adorable is this? So I actually am a child and I'm kind of afraid of the dark. So I like to have a little nightlight and my boyfriend likes it to be pitch black. So I actually gave this to him and he wears it every single night and it's honestly the cutest thing. The other thing that you can get are these awesome sleep socks. <laughs> I don't know if you can like see how soft these are, but they are so comfy, so soft. Honestly, like I see myself wearing these all winter long, just like, not even just to bed, but like I feel like I wanna just wear them around the house because they're so comfy. And I feel like that's all part of relaxing is like getting yourself in that state. Speaking of relaxing, I don't know if you can hear my boyfriend playing Call of Duty right now and yelling, but this is not relaxing and this is not helping with my video, so I apologize for all the noise. I live right next to a highway. I don't know if you can hear it right now, but like I said, a lot of nights it gets super hot in this room and we have to open the window and that shit is just loud. And when he's playing video games, which he often does before bed, it's also loud. There's shooting noises. Honestly, can you blame me for not sleeping? So by the end of the night, I need to take all these steps to relax and I really need these sleep vitamins because honestly, without this, like I am hopeless. I mean, I don't know if you can tell, but there are no bags under my eyes or if there are, this is kind of just the normal amount <laughs> that's there. I have been sleeping again. I haven't been putting out a lot of videos, which you may have noticed because I've just been exhausted. I've just felt like crap. It's just been a lot. I mean, even like you may have noticed my body is different. I gained a lot of weight. I just was not feeling healthy and honestly, having a good sleep routine and a good environment to sleep and finally getting a good rest has made a really big difference for me. So if you are struggling with this as well and you wanna try them and you have questions, feel free to reach out to me about any of the stuff that I've mentioned. Like if you want me to make any more specific videos about other things that I'm doing or what I'm using on my skin, what kind of essential oils I've tried, what kind of sheets I'm using, any of that stuff, any part of this process, that I've either liked or not liked, please feel free to comment or to message me on Instagram. My username is the same. I would be happy to answer any questions you have, give you any advice that I possibly can. If you wanna see more wellness stuff from me, or if you don't wanna see wellness stuff from me at all, <laughs> please let me know how you're feeling about that. This is my channel, so I do wanna make videos about things that matter to me, so I will probably continue to do stuff like this, but I'm open to suggestions and I'm open to hear what you wanna see from me. All right, I'll see you all soon. Thanks for watching.